To prevent ear infections, clean your earplugs regularly with A. Soap and water B. Alcohol C. A soft cloth D. Mineral spirits When welding, what color is the oxygen hose? A. Gray B. Green C. Yellow D. Red If a code of federal regulation standard does not specifically address a workplace hazard, which of the following must be invoked? A. The General Duty Clause B. The Workers' Safety Act of 1984 C. The Code of Construction Safety D. The Workplace Safety and Insurance Act A measure of the probability, consequences, and exposure related to an event is referred to as blank. A. Risk B. Evaluation C. Safety D. Hazard Which of the following data is included on a material safety data sheet for a hazardous shipment? A. The expiration date of the substance B. Net weight criteria for packaging the container C. How to contact the manufacturer of the substance D. Manufacturer's Recommended Product Substitutes Anything that could have caused an injury or damage, but did not because it was caught in time, is referred to as in blank. A. Accident B. Intentional Act C. Injury D. Incident Prolonged exposure to asbestos can cause lung cancer, asbestosis, and blank. A. Pneumonia B. Emphysema C. Black lung D. Mesothelioma What is the best way to protect yourself when working near moving vehicles and equipment? A. Wear a reflective or high visibility vest. B. Have a signaler direct your movements. C. Set up reflective flags around your work area. D. Ensure that a qualified person is on the job site. The deering or support point on a safety harness should be placed blank. A. Over your rib cage. B. In the middle of your back. C. Around your waist. D. Between your shoulder blades. The activity that consists of breaking a job into its component tasks and then analyzing each step for potential hazards is called a blank. A. Hazardous Incident Simulation B. Safety Preassessment C. Job Safety Analysis D. Safety Breakdown Structure Charred sections of a welding hose close to the torch may be caused by blank. A. Flash Burn B. Flare up. C. Slag. D. Flashback. Employers are required to report fatalities and catastrophes to OSHA within blank hours. A. 12. B. 
24. C, 8. D, 4. Which of the following is life-threatening? A. Heat stroke B. Frostbite C. Heat cramps D. Heavy sweating When everyone in the company understands the value of a safe work environment, blank. A. Labor costs increase. B. Productivity declines. C. A safety culture is created. D. The experience modification rate increases. A system that protects workers from hazardous energy while they work with machines and equipment is referred to as blank. A. A barricade system. B. Lockout or tagout. C. A disconnect. D. An energy neutral system. Benching systems cannot be used in blank. A. Type of soils. B. Type B soils. C. Type C soils. D. Solid rock. Safety blank. A. Is a learned behavior and attitude. B. Primarily depends on workers in the field. C. Comes naturally to most individuals. D. Does not normally need to be trained. The smallest mark on an imperial ruler is a millimeter, b one over sixteen inch, c one fourth inch, d one half inch. What are plywood clips used for? A. Straightening floor sheathing. B. Keeping plywood straight in stacks. C. Supporting roof sheathing edges between the trusses. D. There is no such thing as a plywood clip. What is PL400? A. Drill bit size. B. Type of construction adhesive. C. Number of teeth on a hacksaw. D. Plywood specification. What saw would be used to cut a 2 by 4? A. Table saw. B. Circular saw. C. Saber saw. D. Band saw. When nailing 2 by 6 inch joists, what nail should be used? A. 12D. B. 18D. C. 20D. D. All of the above can be used. When squaring up a large rectangular object, which method would be the least acceptable to use? A. 6-8-10 method. B. Calculate a diagonal measurement. C. Measure diagonally both ways. D. Framing square. What type of hammer is commonly selected for trim work? A. Framing hatchet. B. 28 ounce long handle waffle head. C. 20 ounce long handle straight claw. D. 
16 ounce wood handle curved claw. Joist hangers are used for which of the following? A. Supporting joists against beams. B. Keeping joists straight during delivery. C. Inspection. D. There is no such thing as a joist hanger. The path a saw blade cuts in a piece of wood is called A. Waste B. Kerf C. Clearance D. Set What tool is best used to cut nails? A. Reciprocating saw B. Hammer C. Chisel D. Circular saw What tool is best used for shaping wood? A. Circular saw B. Router C. Drill D. Miter saw What size of nail do you commonly use in framing? A. 16D B. 14D C. 18D D. 12D What tool would be used to cut crown molding? A. Circular saw B. Miter saw C. Hammer D. Planer How many 2 by 4 blocks, 22 and 1 half inches long can be cut from a 2 by 4 that is 8 feet long? A. 2 B. 4 C. 6 D. 8 What is the most common length between studs? A. 16 B. 11 C. 15 D. 19 What tool is used to drive a 3-inch screw? A. Hammer B. Cordless drill C. Screwdriver D. Wrench What type of door would work best for a 4, 5, or even a 6-foot closet door? A. Bifold doors B. Sliding closet doors C. Hinges doors D. None of the above What tool is best used to install shingles? A. Drill B. Pneumatic nailer C. Staple gun D. Screwdriver What tool shaves off the thickness of lumber? A. Circular saw B. Planer C. Band saw D. Hammer NCCER Practice Test To get industry certification and prove your constructing abilities, the NCCER Practice Test is an essential step in the process. Your trade abilities and knowledge in the construction business will be assessed with this thorough evaluation. Industry certifications are essential in proving competence and experience to guarantee a highly skilled workforce.
The NCCE or practice test was created especially to evaluate the skills necessary to succeed in a variety of construction trades. Preparing for the NCCE or practice test. Convenience and flexibility. Comprehensive study materials. Interactive learning. Track progress and identify weak areas. Community support.